Well, just a really quick one this time. This is strictly for the Lear, pretty much, no tutorial, but in the time it took that other video to upload, I was able to uh, recode this Arduino for the Learjet uh, pressure panel. So uh, right now it's communicating with FSX, and what I've done is linked it to the avionics. So I'll turn the avionics on just by the virtual cockpit and just click the mouse. <clears throat> the bottom is our... Um, the top is the uh, the change rate for the cabin altitude. The middle is the delta pressure, and the bottom is the uh, the actual cabin altitude, which is just set to FSX for now. So um, I'll just crank this up, and we'll see if we can take off. What I've done is uh, I set the limits um, according to the Learjet on. Um, on the uh, increase and decrease to 600 feet a minute and 350 feet a minute uh, or 375 maybe. Anyway, um, I'm bouncing along the ground here because I'm not on a runway but uh, there we go taking off. You can see our climb rate that's just pulling right through uh, wide open so we're at 600 feet a minute at our uh, uh, altitude of 1500 feet and you see the cabin pressure starts to the delta starts to come up and uh, if we level off we should if I'm trying to fly with a joystick here on a desktop rig uh, you'll see there's the negative max limit reached 375 and you can still see a cabin delta pressure so that'll line up quite well with the uh, with the actual panel um, I just got to maybe do the spacing over to the left side or more to the middle. But uh, yeah, that's about it. Um, couldn't get a nice arrow in front of the upwards on the 600. In the code, I have to do that manually so I could only use that, uh, that symbol without actually drawing it in pixels. But uh, yeah, you can see it works pretty good. Uh, all things considered, that's actually a pretty reasonable reflection of of the cabin conditions. It's not perfect. I should scale it because obviously it's not going to keep up um, when you're really hauling some serious climb and descent rates. So the cabin altitude at the bottom should be offset a bit, but this is more than anything that I've seen before. So it'll, uh, it'll do just fine. Anyway, thanks for watching.